Happy birthday, Nebraska. The final pieces to your state capitol building are here, albeit about 85 years late. It's, it's great. It just, just having them on site is a great thing. They are the four interior courtyard fountains that were part of the original design by Bertram Goodhue. But the Great Depression and a number of other spending priorities over the years kept the fountains on just a wish list. It's wonderful to be here and see them coming into the building. No one is more pleased than Bob Wickersham. Three years ago, he and a number of former lawmakers pushed for the state to approve $2.5 million to complete the Capitol. This is the last element in the design uh, and we'll actually be able to declare the Capitol finished. And I, I think that's a kind of a matter of principle for Nebraskans. When you start something, you want to finish it. This unfinished business, a little tricky, making sure the 1,800 pound bronze bowls and 700 pound bases fit through the doorways. Nice and easy. Even a special car had to be made just for the right angle. This is the kind of building the boat in the bottle part of the project because the pieces all have to fit through the building. The doorway into the southwest courtyard was smaller than the others, so its fountain had to be cut into two pieces, then welded together. The bowls, adorned with Native American symbols for water, rain, and lightning, will be put into place over the next few days. Everyone here has a lot of pride uh, for to put the final touches on the Capitol. And the fountain should be filled and bubbling over the next couple of months with a dedication ceremony later this summer. So we can we can we can finally say it's done. In Lincoln and Rosaki KETV News Watch 7.